A Lucha Libre megastar now looking to dominate WWE. I'd say there's a very good chance he'll do that. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Legado del Fantasma from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 200 pounds, Santos Escobar. Every move Escobar makes honors his family and the tradition of Lucha Libre. Yeah, you've got to watch your step around Santos Escobar because he can drop you in a second. Well, there's an understatement. Escobar's already doled out so much punishment to anyone opposing Legato. Santos Escobar continues to build his empire, and he'll do anything to keep it intact. Escobar is determined to provide and protect his family. Beware, he's full of surprises. Enter the torture machine. It's like Drew Gulak flipped a switch, and he's always on on. A man who loves competition, but loathes his opponents. And his opponent, representing the Vaude Villains from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 193 pounds. Drew Gulak! A proud native of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, a walking torture device. Yeah, Drew Gulak has often said that wrestling in Philadelphia made him tougher. Drew Gulak has a distinctive reputation as a submission specialist. An incredibly high in-ring IQ and raw determination possessed by Gulak. Santos Escobar, second generation heir to a Lucha Libre legacy. A man who tore off his mask and is trying to create a tradition of his own. That's right, Cole. Santos Escobar put it all on the line when he rejected the mask. He wants to create a new tradition to put the spotlight on victories and modern excellence. Thus far, it's paid off. The leader of Legato Del Fantasma looking to add to his new tradition in this match. And what can you say about Drew Gulak other than he's a man who has dedicated his entire life to mastering wrestling. He's a no-frills competitor who is all about substance in the ring. Even I have to admit, Gulak's knowledge of grappling is staggering. But it's that incredible mind for wrestling that makes him a constant threat to any superstar that crosses his path. Mm. Ah, stop to the belly. Escobar is picking the competition apart. Gulak has to start trusting his instincts at this point. And all of Gulak's in-ring knowledge couldn't get him out of harm's way there. Escobar showcasing that second-generation Lucha Libre skill. Enable to counter. Yeah, but Escobar needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. He saw it coming, taking advantage. The whole ring in between them, and a collision in the corner. From the middle rope. And the momentum's clearly against Gulak now. Santos is showing no mercy out here. There's the path. What are you doing here, Corey? The colossal clutch. An extreme amount of... Slip right underneath. And just like that, he's out of the hole. Just pure dominance. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. Uh, ducked underneath. Instead, what a German suplex. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's going to love this. Doom Buster! And that's an example of a new and vicious tradition Escobar wants his name. Taking flight. Drop splash nailed it. So dangerous in so many different ways. Here's just another example. Absolutely punishing his opponent. Oh, wait a second. Oh, into the 
Dragon Sleeper, are you kidding me? That's got to be it. And you Fighting desperately, and he's out. Dropkick. A fireman's carry into the oh, slam. slam. Here we go. He paid for that one. Oh man, big time. Uh oh, nothing funny about this. Jokerplex. A no frills assault by Gulak. That's what a true master of his craft is capable of. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Heading to the pin window. This is where great cardio makes all the difference, helping you stay alive deep into the match. The Gulak, the Gulak is locked in. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how to counter this thing. I don't want to see him tap out. Not like this. Rolls through. Nice escape. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's gonna love this. Doom Buster! Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. That could finish Drew off. There he goes, right into the corner. Up top, up top, heading up to the top rope. This is gonna be nasty. High rent district, lot of risk up here. Landslide. Escobar has this wrapped up. Let's take another look at these guys in action. Here is your winner, Santos Escobar. They went the extra mile in this win. I agree. What a win. I guess Gulak needs to double-check the numbers in his PowerPoint presentation to figure out exactly what went wrong tonight.